Uh, Proverbs chapter 8. Doth not wisdom cry, and understanding put forth her voice? She standeth in the top of high places, by the way in the places of the paths. She cried at the gates, at the entry of the city, at the coming in at the doors. Unto you, O men, I call, and my voice is to the sons of man. O ye simple, understand wisdom, and ye fools, be ye of an understanding heart. Hear, for I will speak of excellent things, and the opening of my lips shall be right things. For my mouth shall speak truth, and wickedness is an abomination to my lips. All the words of my mouth are in righteousness. There is nothing froward or perverse in them. They are all plain to him and that understand it and right to dumb that find knowledge. Receive my instruction and not silver and knowledge rather than choice gold. For wisdom is better than rubies and all the things that may be desired are not to be compared to it. I wisdom dwell with prudence and find out knowledge of witty inventions. The fear of the Lord is to hate evil, pride and arrogancy and the evil way. And the froward mouth do I hate. Counsel is mine and sound wisdom. I am understanding. I have strength. By me kings reign and princes decree justice. By me princes rule and nobles, even all the judges of the earth. I love them that love me, and those that see me early shall find me. Riches and honor are with me, yes, durable riches and righteousness. My fruit is better than gold, yes, than fine gold. And my revenue, that choice silver. I lead in the way of righteousness, in the midst of the paths of judgment, that I may cause those that love me to inherit substance, and I will fill their treasures. The Lord possessed me in the beginning of his way, before his works of old. I was set up from everlasting from the beginning, or ever the earth was. When there were no depths, I was brought forth. When there were no fountains, bounding with water. Before the mountains were settled, before the hills was I brought forth. While as yet he had not made the earth, nor the fields, nor the highest part of the dust of the world. When he prepared the heavens, I was there. When he set a compass upon the face of the death, when he established the clouds above, when he strengthened the fountains of the deep, when he gave to the sea his decree that the water should not pass his commandment, when he appointed the foundations of the earth. Then I was by him as one brought up with him, and I was daily at his delight, rejoicing always before him, rejoicing in the ha habitable part of his earth and my delights were with the sons of men. Now therefore hearken unto me, O ye children, for blessed are they that keep my ways. Hear instruction, and be wise, and refuse it not. Blessed is the man that heareth me, watching daily at my gates, waiting at the posts of my doors. For whoso findeth me findeth life, and shall in favor of the Lord. But he that sinned against me wronged his own soul. All they that hate me love death.
chapter 9. Wisdom had built, built her house. She had hewn out her seven pillars. She had killed her beasts. She had mingled her wine. She had also furnished her table. She had sent forth her maidens. She cried upon the highest places of the city. Whoso is simple, let him turn in hither. As for him that wanted understanding, she said to him, Come, eat of my bread, and drink of the wine which I have mingled. Forsake the foolish and live, and go in the way of understanding. He that reproved a scorner get it in himself to himself shame, and he that rebuked a wicked man get it himself a blot. Reprove not a scorner, lest he hate thee. Rebuke a wise man, and he will love thee. Give instruction to a wise man, and he will be yet wiser. Teach a just man, and he will increase his learning. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, and the knowledge of the holy is understanding. For by me thy days shall be multiplied, and the years of thy life shall be increased. If thou be wise, thou shalt be wise for thyself. But if thou scornest, thou alone shalt bear it. A foolish woman is clamorous, she is simple and knoweth nothing. For she sitteth at the door of her house on a seat in the high places of the city. To call passengers who go right on their ways, whoso is simple, let him turn in hither. And, it, and as for him that wanted understanding, she said to him, Stolen waters are sweet, and bread eaten in secret is pleasant. But he knoweth not that the dead are there, and that her guests are in the depths of hell. Proverbs chapter 10. The Proverbs of Solomon, a wise son make it a glad father, but a foolish son is the heaviness of his mother. Treasures of wickedness profit nothing, but righteousness deliver it from death. The Lord will not suffer the soul of the righteous to famish, but he casteth away the substance of the wicked. He becometh poor that deleted with a slack hand, but the hand of the diligent make it rich. He that gathereth in summer is a wise son, but he that sleepeth in harvest is a son that causeth shame. Blessings are upon the head of the just, but violence covered the mouth of the wicked. The memory of the just is blessed but the name of the wicked shall rot. The wise in heart will receive commandments, but a prating fool shall fall. He that walketh uprightly walketh surely, but he that perverted his ways shall be known. He that winketh with the eye causeth sorrow, but a prating fool shall fall. The mouth of a righteous man is a well of fire, but violence Cover it the mouth of the wicked. Hatred stirred up strives, but love covered all sins. In the lips of him that had understanding, wisdom is found. But a rod is the for the back of him that is void of understanding. Wise men laid up knowledge, but the mouth of the foolish is near destruction. The richest man wealth is his strong city. The destruction of the poor is their poverty. The labor of the righteous tendeth to live to life, the fruit of the wicked to sin. He is in the way of life that keepeth instruction, but he that refuseth reproof erreth. 
He that hided hatred with lying lips, and he that uttered a slander is a fool. In the multitude of words there wanteth not sin, but he that refraineth his lips is wise. The tongue of the just is as choice silver. The heart of the wicked is little worth. The lips of the righteous feed many, but fools die for want of wisdom. The blessing of the Lord, it make it rich, and he added no sorrow with it. It is a sport to a fool to do mischief, but a man of understanding had wisdom. The fear of the wicked, it shall come upon him, but the desire of the righteous shall be granted. As the whirlwind passage, so is the wicked no more, but the righteous is an everlasting foundation. As vinegar to the teeth, and as smoke to the eye, so is the slugger to them that send him. The fear of the Lord prolongeth days, but the years of the wicked shall be shortened. The hope of the righteous shall be gladness, but the expectation of the wicked shall perish. The way of the Lord is strengthened to upright, but destruction shall be to the workers of iniquity. The righteous shall never be removed, but the wicked shall not inhabit the earth. The mouth of the just bringeth forth wisdom, but the froward tongue shall be cut out. The lips of righteousness know that it is acceptable, but the mouth of the wicked speaketh froners. Proverbs chapter 11 A false balance is abomination to the Lord, but a just weight is his delight. When pride cometh, then cometh shame, but with the lowly is wisdom. The integrity of the upright shall guide them, but the perverseness of transgressors shall destroy them. Riches profit not in the day of wrath, but righteousness deliver it from death. The righteousness of the perfect shall direct his way, but the wicked shall fall by his own wickedness. The righteousness of the upright shall deliver them, but transgressors shall be taken in their own naughtiness. When a wicked man dieth, his expectation shall perish, and the hope of an unjust man perish. The righteous is delivered out of trouble, and the wicked cometh in his stead. An hypocrite with his mouth destroyeth his neighbor, but through knowledge shall the just be delivered. When it goeth well with the righteous, the city rejoiceth, and when the wicked perish, there is no shouting. There, when the wicked perish, there is shouting. By the blessing of the upright, the city is exalted, but it is overthrown by the mouth of the wicked. He that is void of freedom despises his neighbor, but a man of understanding holdeth his peace. A tale-bearer revealed secrets, but he that is of the faithful spirit concealed the matter. Where no counsel is, the people fall, but in the multitude of counselors there is safety. He is that he that is surety for a stranger shall smart for it, and he that hated sureship is sure. A gracious woman retained honor, and strong men retained riches. The merciful man doeth good to his own soul. But he that is cruel troubled his own flesh. The wicked worketh a deceitful work, but to him that soweth righteousness shall be a sure to reward. The righteousness tended to live life, so he that pursueth evil pursueth it to his own death. They that are a froward heart are abomination to the Lord, but such are a are upright in their way are his delight. 
thought hand join in hand. The wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. As a jewel of gold in swine's snout, so is a fair woman which is without discretion. The desire of the righteous is only good, but the expectation of the wicked is wrath. There is the scattered and yet increase it. There is that withhold it more than is meat, but it tended to poverty. The liberal soul shall be made fat, and he that water it shall be watered also himself. He that withhold it corn, the people shall curse him, but blessing shall be upon the head of him that sell it. He that diligently seeketh good procured favor, but he that seeketh mischief, it shall come unto him. He that trusteth in his riches shall fall, but the righteous shall flourish as a branch. He that troubled his own house shall inherit the wind, and the fool shall be servant to the wise of heart. The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he that winneth souls is wise. Behold, the righteous shall be recompensed in the earth, much more than much more the wicked and the sinner. Proverbs chapter twelve. Whoso loveth instruction loveth knowledge, but he that hateth reproof is brutish. A good man obtained his favor of the Lord, but a man of wicked devices will be condemned. A man shall not be established by wickedness, but the root of the righteous shall not be moved. A virtuous woman is a crown to her husband, but she that make it ashamed is as rottenness in his bones. The thoughts of the righteous are right, but the counsels of the wicked are deceit. The words of the wicked are to lie in wait for blood. But the mouth of the upright shall deliver them. The wicked are thrown overthrown and are not. But the house of the righteous shall stand. A man shall be con commanded according to his wisdom. But he that is a perverse heart shall be despised. He that is a spies and had a servant is better than he that honored himself and lacked bread. A righteous man regarded the life of his beast, but the tender mercies of the wicked are cruel. He that tileth his land shall be satisfied with bread, but he that followed vain persons is void of understanding. The wicked desired the net of evil men, but the root of the righteous yielded fruit. The wicked is snared by the transgression of his lips, but the just shall come out of trouble. A man shall be satisfied with good by the fruit of his mouth, and the recompense of a man's hand shall be rendered unto him. The way of a fool is right in his own eyes. But he that hearkened unto counsel is wise. A fool's wrath is presently known, but a prudent man covered shame. He that speaketh truth soweth for righteousness, but a false witness deceit. There is speaketh like the piercings of a sword, but the tongue of the wise is health. The lip of truth shall be established forever. But a lying tongue is but for a moment. Deceit is in the heart of them that imagine evil, but to the counselors of peace is joy. There shall no evil happen to the just, but the wicked shall be filled with mischief. Lying lips are abomination to the Lord, but they that deal truly are his delight. A prudent man concealed knowledge, but the heart of fools proclaimeth foolishness. The hand of the diligent shall bear rule, but the slothful shall be under tribute. Heaviness in the 
heart of man make it stoop, but a good word make it glad. The righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the way of the wicked seduceth them. The slothful man roasted not that which he took in hunting, but the substance of a diligent man is precious. In the way of righteousness is life, in the pathway thereof there is no death. Chapter 13 A wise son heareth his father's instruction, but a scorner heareth not rebuke. A man shall eat good by the fruit of his mouth, but the soul of the transgressor shall eat violence. He that keepeth his mouth keepeth his life, but he that openeth wide his lips shall have destruction. The soul of the slugger desired and had nothing but the soul of the diligent shall be made fat. A righteous man hated lying, but a wicked man is loathsome and cometh to shame. Righteousness keepeth him that is upright in the way, but wickedness overthroweth the sinner. There is that maketh himself rich, yet had nothing. There is that make it himself poor, yet had it great riches. The ransom of a man's life are his riches, but the poor hear it not rebuke. The light of the righteous rejoiceth, but the lamp of the wicked shall be put out. Only by pride cometh contention, but with the well-advised is wisdom. Wealth gotten by vanity, shall be diminished, but he that gathered by labor shall increase. Hope deferred maketh the heart sick, but when the desire cometh, it is a tree of life. Whoso despiseth the word shall be destroyed, but he that feareth the commandment shall be rewarded. The law of the wise is a fountain of life, to depart from the snares of death. Good understanding giveth favor, but the way of transgressors is hard. Every prudent man dealeth with knowledge, but a fool layeth open his folly. A wicked messenger fall into mischief, but a faithful ambassador is health. Poverty and shame shall be to him that refuseth instruction, but he that regardeth reproof shall be honored. The desire accomplished is sweet to the soul, but it is an abomination to fools to depart from evil. He that walketh wise men shall be wise, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Evil pursueth sinners, but to the righteous good shall be repaid. A good man leaveth an inheritance to his children's children, and the wealth of the sinner is laid up for the just. Much food is in the village of the poor, but there is that is destroyed of for want of judgment. He that spared his rod hated his son, but he that loved him chastened him betimes. The righteous eat it to the satisfying of his soul, but the belly of the wicked shall want. Chapter 14 Every wise woman builded her house, but the foolish plucketh it down with her hands. He that walketh in his uprightness feareth the Lord, but he that is perverse in his ways despised him. In the mouth of the foolish is a rod of pride, but the lips of the wise shall perverse them. Where no oxen are, the crib is clean, but much increase it is by the strength of the ox. A faithful witness will not lie, but a false witness will utter lies. A scorner seeketh wisdom and findeth not, but knowledge is easy unto them, him that understandeth. 
Go from the presence of a foolish man, when thou perverse not to him the lips of knowledge. The wisdom of the prudent is to understand his way, but the folly of fools is deceit. Fools make a mock of sin at sin, but among the righteous there is favor. The heart knoweth his own bitterness, and a stranger doth not intermediate meddle with his joy. The house of the wicked shall be overthrown, but the tabernacle of the upright shall flourish. There is a way which seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. Even in laughter the heart is sorrowful, and the end of that merit is heaviness. The backslider in the heart shall be filled with his own ways, and a good man shall be satisfied from himself. The simple believeth every word, but the prudent man looketh well to his going. A wise man feareth and departeth from evil, but the fool rageth and is confident. He that is soon angry feeleth fool, and a man of wicked devices is hated. The simple inherit folly, but the prudent are crowned with knowledge. The evil bow before the good, and the wicked at the gates of the righteous. The poor is hated, even of his own neighbor, but the, right, the rich had many friends. He that despiseth his neighbor sinneth, but he that had mercy on the poor happy is he. Do they not err the device evil? But mercy and truth shall be to them that devise good. In all labor there is profit, but the talk of lips tended only to penury. The crown of the wise is their riches, but the foolishness of fools is folly. A true witness delivered souls, but a deceitful witness speaketh lies. In the fear of the Lord is strong confidence, and his children shall have a place of refuge. The fear of the Lord is a fountain of life to depart from the snares of death. In the multitude of people is the king's honor, but in the want of people is the destruction of the prince. He that is slow to wrath is of great understanding, but he that is hasty of spirit exalted fully. A sound heart is, of the, of the, is the life of the flesh, but envy the rottenness of the bones. He that oppresseth the poor reproacheth his maker, but he that honored him had mercy on the poor. The wicked is driven away in his wickedness, but the righteous had hope in his death. Wisdom restraineth, re, wisdom rested in the heart of him that had understanding, but that which is the, in the midst of fools is made known. Righteousness exalted a nation, but sin is a reproach to any people, to any people. The king's favor is toward a wise servant, but his wrath is against him that causeth shame.
exchanged my heart of stone For one of flesh and put life in my bones And all I can say is holy